In this video, we're going to see if we can clean up a paint spill using a paint remover from Goof Off, specifically for carpet. I wanted to get a really good test of this product, so I decided to try an oil-based paint, which is this orange one, a water-based paint, and then a spray paint. I don't know how fair of a test it is, but I decided to pour on a big glob like this, and then a smaller drop, and kind of smear it, just like you would get if you had an accidental stain. I'll do the exact same thing for this water-based paint too. I want to get a really good test on this stuff. For the spray paint, I just lightly sprayed in one section like you get for some overspray. Then on the back there, I kind of smeared it into the carpet like maybe somebody stepped on it or something. Now I'll let it dry for a couple days and we'll get a really good test on this product. One quick note about the directions on the back of this product is that Goof Off recommends that if you spill wet paint on the carpet, that you allow it to dry first and then you use the same procedures for dry paint removal. I'd say these are pretty heavy duty stains, so I'm gonna go straight into the heavy duty cleaning instructions. Once we've waited the recommended soaking time, we're ready to try to get these stains out. Right away, I can tell that this spray paint's gonna come up, but it's gonna take a couple times to get it all. The small stain on the water base, it's starting to come up too, but not as quickly. And then that big glob is pretty well frozen solid. On the oil based paint, it looks like it's just smearing it really bad. It might be getting a little bit lighter, but it's definitely smearing a lot. On both those big globs for the water and oil based, it looks like they're not gonna come up anytime soon. It'll take some serious soaking. Now I'll soak it and let it sit for about an hour. After an hour of soaking, we're pretty much getting the same results. The spray paint and the light water-based spill are continuing to come up. The two big globs might be getting a little bit softer, and that light oil-based paint is smearing like crazy. Let's drench these stains and let them sit overnight. After letting them sit overnight, I drench them one more time and let them sit for about an hour before I scrub them with a scrub brush. The only thing bad about a brush like this is it can untwist your carpet. This can make your carpet wear out more quickly. That orange oil-based paint is smearing all over the place. I probably wouldn't recommend this for an oil-based paint. After scrubbing for quite a while, I cleaned it up as best I could with a rag. I used every drop of that carpet cleaner too. For the final result, the spray paint and the light water-based paint are pretty well gone. Those two big globs are gonna require a lot more soaking. That light oil-based paint is coming up, but you want to be really careful about smearing. Overall, we had a pretty tough test today, but I think it was somewhat successful. If I needed to clean up spray paint or a light water-based paint, I'd definitely use it. But for an oil-based paint, I'd probably try to find something else. If you have one of these lighter stains and you want to try this out, please check the description below. Also, don't forget to click that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you next time.